laugh too hard. At 161 pounds, His Royal Highness, High Class! Welcome to Pure Power Wrestling Power Slam. Here on Shaw Spotlight, my name is Sydney Steele. Bulldog McBain for one more week, still on hiatus, and I am about 24 hours away from being medically cleared to return to action in the PPW ring. So of course, here tonight, I am being served the ultimate insult, the ultimate injustice, being forced to call our match here versus high class, one of my favorite professional wrestlers up and coming here in Western Canada as he takes on the PPW heavyweight champion, Kyle Sebastian. Now that, that puts a little bit of a lump in my throat, ladies and gentlemen, to have to say very, very difficult for me to get those words out. But tonight, High Class is going to punish Kyle Sebastian. I spoke with him in the back earlier this evening and I encouraged him to do anything he can to punish Kyle, to put Kyle out before tomorrow night when PPW returns to Lethbridge with high impact and Kyle Sebastian is stretched, is torn, is put down and beaten by Johnny Devine. What, what can I say? What can I say about Kyle Sebastian? I, it's been requested by PPW management that I do my best to remain professional, to remain impartial here tonight. I, I genuinely don't think I'm going to be able to. But Kyle Sebastian, the PPW heavyweight champion, I'll come right up and say it. Beat me inside of a steel cage for that PPW Heavyweight Championship. The reason I am at, at the commentary desk calling this show as opposed to being in the ring defending that championship is Kyle Sebastian, one of the toughest competitors that Western, Can Western Canada, pardon me, getting a little flustered here by... Sebastian, a guy I can't stand being in the ring, one of the best competitors that Western Canada has ever produced in a hundred years of producing professional wrestlers is Kyle Sebastian. Whether I like him or I hate him or I like it or I hate it, Kyle Sebastian is the PPW heavyweight champion and unfortunately Cougar meat. Oh, absolutely, absolutely crass. Crass from Kyle Sebastian. Not the behavior of a heavyweight champion. We've got the Prince of Ghana, high class. Classy, it's right in his name. Taking on, I mean, a sleazy, a gross, a disgusting competitor in Kyle Sebastian. Like I said, one of the best Western Canada has ever produced. Unfortunately, just a little classless. And the crowd here, the crowd here in Nanton, showing high class, absolutely zero respect chanting princess as the bell sounds and we are underway here high class versus sebastian here on power slam <laughs> high class a little bit distracted it seems here by the fans in the early going 
It may be inexperience from high class, allowing him to get frazzled, allowing him to pay a little bit more attention to the fans than to the heavyweight champion. And that is going to come back to bite high class. I've been in the ring with Kyle Sebastian countless times, and I know that if your focus is not 100% on Kyle Sebastian, you will not win that match. We've got a collar and elbow tie-up in the center of the ring. Surprisingly, it looked like High Class had the advantage for a moment, but Sebastian, the bigger competitor, easily able to drive him into the corner. Got a polite applause here from the fans in Nanton for that display of power from Sebastian. Can't take anything away. Sebastian with the go-behind and the Olympic lift. Half Nelson into that chest-to-chest -chest cover. Sebastian now with the front face lock. Can't take anything away from his power game. Can't take anything away from his technical ability as High Class now transitions into an arm wrench. Sebastian though able to create a little bit of space, just enough space to roll through, head spring, and now he's got High Class in that hammer lock. High Class able to reverse, go behind on Sebastian. Sebastian though with the drop, toe hold, and oh, just toying, toying with high class. Come on, Kyle. Come on, Sebastian. And again, the fans here in Nanton showing absolute, utter disrespect for the Prince of Ghana, the Crown Prince of Ghana, Mr. High Class himself. Well, these fans should bow down. They should bow down to high class. Kyle Sebastian should bow down to high class with a shot to the midsection and dropping Sebastian with a DDT. DDT very early on in this match. Coming in, following it up with a European uppercut and a running body splash. High class measuring. Looks for that running body splash again. Sebastian able to get out of the way. Shot to the midsection and a thunderous chop. Oh my god. And Sebastian follows things up with a running European uppercut of himself. I have never. I have never made it a secret just how much I. Oh, for the love of God. Big chop. I have never made it a secret just how much I hate, I despise Kyle Sebastian. But I will never say, never will I say he is not one of the best to step into a PPW ring. Running drop kick to the face, back press, hook of the leg. Not quite enough weight across those shoulders of high class to get the win this early on in the match. Sebastian with the scoop. And the slam puts High Class down. Show of athleticism here from Sebastian. And up and over with the senton over the top. High Class is really feeling it now. High Class is in pain down on the mat. And the heavyweight champion just might be too much for High Class to take here tonight. High Class with a shot to the midsection. Going for the Irish whip. Sebastian, though, looks for the crossbody off the middle rope. And High Class able to duck out of the way. Nobody home for Kyle Sebastian crashing down on the mat. High Class now with the stomps. Stomp right to the rib, right to those floating ribs of Kyle Sebastian. And now a choke in the corner blatantly in front of the referee. Technical marvel. The most technical choke I think I've ever seen. Running hip attack to the head of Sebastian. There we go. Big uppercut from high class. 
I, I love to see it. I dislike Sebastian enough that I love to see it. A splash followed by a bulldog driving Sebastian face first into the mat. Hooks the leg, one, two, two, only two. Not enough to put the heavyweight champion away. And high class with a beautiful snap suplex. Floating over into a cover. Only two. Only a two count. High class can argue with the official. All he wants is not going to change things. These fans getting behind Sebastian. High class with a chin lock, and we've got to take a very brief break. Hey everybody, what's up? Jim Dandy here, reminding you, we're just days away from Pure Power Wrestling's next event, High Impact, this Saturday, May 21st, 7 p.m. bell time at the Fritz Six Center. But today, I am thrilled, absolutely excited to have one of my favorite performers sitting beside me. Hey everybody, please welcome Travis the Heat Copeland. Thanks Jim, thank you for having me. Very nice to have you. Travis. 449 days, the cruiserweight champion, the, the summer sizzler winner, the gauntlet for the gold winner, the power rumble winner. You've just about done it all at your power wrestling. Just about, I, I've just about done it all. You have. Hey, let's talk about your return. Eight months you were out with a near career ending shoulder injury. I was there, I seen it happen. It was devastating. Eight months you've been working back to get back to Pure Power Wrestling. Eight months of rehabilitation, physiotherapy. Here you are, ready to make your climb up the ladder of Pure Power Wrestling. Yeah, it was, uh, it was very interesting. You know, those first couple days were pretty rough. You know, if you guys don't know, I completely separated all the ligaments, all the tendons in my, in my shoulder up here. It was... Uh, very painful few weeks. Uh, pretty much could not move my arm for multiple months. Um, day to day activities, getting out of bed, putting on your socks were pretty much impossible. I know. I know. <laughs> Saturday night, 6.30, doors open. 7 o'clock, ass kickings begin. And I get to wrestle, well, I, I get to really, really have some fun on Saturday because Power Pro Wrestling just crowned a new champion, Kyle Sebastian. Very, very talented kid. Really, really, really a stud. But, unfortunately for him, he's kind of like a diamond in the rough, right? In the rough, in so much as he's never had pressure Apply. Yeah, he just came through a really grueling cage match. But I assure you, it's nothing like the dungeon style he's going to experience Saturday. So Lethbridge, I encourage you to come down and watch me become new Power Pro Wrestling Champion. Kyle Sebastian, I'm sorry. Well, I'm sorry, I'm not sorry for the ass kicking you're about to receive. And you just heard there from Johnny Devine, the man who is going to make Sebastian suffer tomorrow night as PPW returns to Lethbridge to the Fritzsick Memorial Center. The main event, Kyle Sebastian, Johnny Devine in singles action. Tickets still available at King of Trade and purepowerwrestling.ca. A brief flurry there from Sebastian, but high class, able to cut him off, able to take over. 
High class now going up to the middle rope. Going all the way up top. Off the top with a splash. Kyle Sebastian though kicks out. The toughness of Sebastian on display in this match and will be on display tomorrow night when Pure Power Wrestling returns to the Fritz Sick Memorial Center. Tickets on sale right now. PurePowerWrestling.ca and King of Trade. Kyle Sebastian taking on Johnny Devine and myself, Sydney Steele, going one-on-one -on -one with the cowboy, Bryn Watts. Sebastian now draped over that bottom rope and high class, putting all of that weight on the back of the neck, throat first across the bottom rope. High class doesn't have a lot of weight on his side, but what he does have, he is able to use incredibly effectively. Another running uppercut here from high class. If it works, keep using it. If it is doing the damage, you keep using it. And a chop of his own from high class. Looking pretty proud of himself. And a follow up chop from high class. Really enjoying things here now. This crowd really letting him have it here in Nanton. Oh, and a third chop from high class to the heavyweight champion, Kyle Sebastian. Oh, and Sebastian with a shot and a big overhand shot to the back. Oh, and a chop of his own to high class. And the chop to the back. Oh, for the love of God. Sebastian with this brutality to high class. High class. Uh, I mean, a referee saying going to the eyes, I think it may be a slip of the hand as high class drops a leg across the back of the head of Sebastian. Side press, hooking the leg, only two. High class transitioning now into that rear chin lock. This rear chin lock, he's got it in very tight, cutting off the wind of Kyle Sebastian. Sebastian though, Getting back to his feet and a jawbreaker, big jawbreaker, puts high class down. That jawbreaker, the, the top of the head up under the jaw, you can feel your teeth click together. And Sebastian off, and this time connecting with the big flying crossbody, rallying these fans behind him. Kyle Sebastian, I've said before, I hate this man, but I cannot take anything away from his ability inside the ring as he puts High Class down with a clothesline, followed by a back elbow and a beautiful drop kick up under the jaw. Back press, only two, not enough to put High Class away here. And if High Class could knock off the heavyweight champion, he might just become my favorite professional wrestler outside, of course, of myself, as Sebastian taking a page out of the Book of Steel with the big stalling brain buster. High Class, though, kicking out at two. Un unheralded toughness from High Class. An incredibly tough competitor and maybe not given the credit for that that he deserves. Sebastian with the Irish whip. Ducks one. High class floats through. Side Russian leg sweep from the Ghanaian Prince. And a DDT. You saw the spike. Come on, high class. Come on, high class. Make the cover. Come on. Come on. Put him away. Put him away. Let's go. Hook the leg. Side press. 
Maybe a little slow. Maybe a little slow on the cover. Come on, high class. Maybe a little slow on the cover. Come on, high class. Come on, high class. Let's go. He's got to put Kyle Sebastian away before he goes one-on-one -on -one tomorrow night with Johnny Devine in Lethbridge at the Fritz Six Center for the PPW Heavyweight Championship. Sebastian, he's got high class up. I don't like this. High class though fighting out. Shot to the midsection. And high class looking for a big move. Sebastian sliding through. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. And oh, puts high class down. No. Sitting on the face of the Prince of Ghana. One, two, three. And the one outcome. I was hoping we wouldn't get as, oh, oh, this, I mean, just makes me sick. Makes me sick to see Kyle Sebastian hoist that PPW Heavyweight Championship. For Pure Power Wrestling, I'm Sydney Steele. We will see you tomorrow at the Fritz Sick Memorial Center.